Hello, Darth Vegan here, back with another episode of Kerbal Space Program. Today I'm going to be showing you a quick tutorial on how to use auto struts. Now, auto struts are a great little tool that allow you to automatically place struts between the part that you have selected and the heaviest part on the rocket or the root part of the rocket, which generally is your command pod, or it could be something like a, uh, a docking port or something of that nature. Or you could even do the grandparent part of your current selected part. But I, I generally use the heaviest part. So what you do is you right click on the part that you want to use the auto strut. And then you just select the little blue button. And it goes to the next selection in, in the queue. The first one is always heaviest part, which is the one that I always use. Now you may be saying, well, when I right click on a part, I don't get that option. Well, that's because you have to first turn on advanced tweakables. And so I will now show you how to do just that. Okay, so once you start up your Kerbal Space Program game, uh, you come to the main menu here, and this is where you turn on the advanced tweakables that will allow you to use the auto strutting uh, functionality and, and there's some other functionality you can use as well with this uh, option turned on so you click on settings and then you find the advanced tweakables and turn those on here <laughs> took me a second to find it. right here advanced tweakables just make sure that is selected click to accept that and that will take you back and then when you go into your loaded game, or if you start a new game, then you will be able to use the advanced tweakables. So you bring up a rocket here, any old rocket will do. You right click on the part you want to add the auto strut and select the struts that you want to use. Now this adds a lot of nice uh, stability to your rocket. I still tend to use these uh, physical struts because I just do. I don't even think they're strictly necessary, but every little bit of support uh, never hurts anyone. So, uh, if this uh, if this little tutorial helped you out, please consider leaving a like on this video. Leave me a comment to let me know that it helped you out, or just to say hi. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.